I want to show you guys my uh, so-called uh, book I got today. And then that it's a uh, painter at work. You know, uh, this book here, it was recommended to me. Who was it that recommended me? Some guy I know. I already got the labels printed out for tomorrow. I got four items I sold on eBay, so they're going out tomorrow. But anyway, um, they, um, that someone has recommended this book. And I, it, it arrived today. And, um, is this the, oh, these are the brushes. I also bought some more brushes. I mean, my brother-in-law was here and he was like, man, you're crazy. Why are you always buying brushes and brushes? I mean, I mean, he was like, oh, you know, it's nice that you spend your money on things that you, you know, something you, you enjoy doing. Okay, fine, but I do have enough brushes. And, uh, these are them right here. You know, I, I'm not so thrilled about them because I wanted to use them with uh, oil. I mean, they're okay. I mean, for what I pay, I think I paid 20 bucks for all of them, for like 10 of them for watercolor. So that's okay. And uh, I just wanted something like for fine detail. I have a lot of brushes. I have a lot. But I just needed something to refine details and in fact I'm just realizing right now that this brush is I mean clean it and tomorrow will be dry. But um yeah I um bought this there's 10 of them that I bought for $20, and uh, they're a weird brand, uh, Crayola. And um, they're okay, I guess. They're kind of short, but the details, and they're always uh, short, short, short brushes, but I guess for watercolors, they're okay. For my nieces when they come, I don't like the way this one just. It's supposed to be synthetic and sable. I'm not really seeing any sable in there, to be honest with you. I'm not seeing no sable. They all look 100%. What does it say? No, these are, these are synthetic. I don't know why this guy said that they were sable and synthetic mixed together. I don't know. But that's where I got them because it combination of synthetic and... Anyway. You know, people need this little detail. But, um... I have so much brushes that, but uh, so the book came. Let's go through it together. And uh, I bought me a pair. Excuse me, a set of headphones. But uh, let's. See. This is the book right here. I have a lot of books on my brand, so I'm wondering if, if it's anything I already have. And it's a uh, painter at work, so I guess it's how uh, he painted. Uh,
breaking up already? It says it's breaking up. No, it's okay. I got it pretty cheap, so I can't really be too picky for what I pay for it. I mean, the book and hard cup is going for like, uh, some places for a uh, hundred bucks, two hundred bucks. So, but what I pay for it in so in a uh, paperback, it's the one that I'm dying to get is uh, by uh, Richard Shems. Uh, I've been dying to get his book, but his book is going for like three hundred, two hundred, a hundred, depending where you get it. And I'm going to have to get that book. I think I'm going to have to get that book. I know it's going to hurt me to spend a hundred bucks on a book, but you know what? I'm going to get it and make sure I read it. I read all my books, but I want to make sure I read that one a couple of times. It's supposed to be uh, all his secrets, everything he's learned all through his career. This guy's still painting, he's still, he's, I think he's uh, in his 70s right now. He's teaching, and but um, I think he's around 68, 70. And uh, oh, look at these eyes. It's so, it's so, uh, this guy only had uh, a limited palette. He didn't have a lot of colors. Uh, earth tones, yellow ochres, burnt sienas, umbers. That's it. Whites, black. I think he used, like, his palette was, like, maybe six colors. Some, uh, some red, I, I don't know. But um, I don't remember too well exactly his palette, but what is this? Oh, these are the old style palettes. Hmm. Oh, look at the little finger ones. Little finger ones. A couple of like they just put a couple of paints. Like right here, you can see. So one, two, three, four, five, six, six colors. Like six colors. This is Rembrandt right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hmm, seven colors. White. Uh, some type of. Uh, it must be like a yellow ochre. That's like uh, burnt sienna, black, raw umber, and I, can, I wonder what type of red that is. I believe. Yeah, I'm gonna have to read this book. And to start from the very beginning, so, okay, let me start from here, reference, acknowledgements, Rembrandt, contract work, introduction, Rembrandt, an achievement, okay, okay, we're going to start from here, I'll read, uh, let me see, I'll read a couple of pages. up there and I got books up there on Rembrandt. Uh, I got books over here and I have more over here. 
That big one of Da Vinci. Oh, look at that big one I'm wearing. I'm right over to that big one. Okay. Classical Master at War. All of these books. Let me put them all away. Okay. I bought some jerseys uh, at a second hand store. To put them up on um, on eBay. But, well, we got two jerseys, me and my brother-in-law, uh, from the Lakers. One of the Lakers. That those numbers they don't. Those numbers they uh, not using those numbers no more. So these two are gonna go up on eBay. When I get a chance, that'll go up. Let me put this over here for now. And uh, what else? Um, that's it, I guess. Uh, I think. Anyway, um, where did she go? Anyway, so, yeah, those brushes, I don't even know why I bought them. I really like longer brushes for detail, long handle, but short handle is okay, I can get away with it. Yeah, there's still a couple of more books I want to get. Uh, but that book, I highly recommend that book. Painter at Work, you gotta get that book. And if you're following me on Facebook and you want to get a good book of how Rembrandt, his, uh, how he painted and how he did his work and that's the book to get. Uh, this one also, uh, uh, Secrets from the Master. Mastering the Craft of Painting. All these traditional oil painting. These are all, you see, masterpieces of drawing. These are all good books. I have that program that can make hands-on education affordable. In the lab, you will be exposed to practical applications of theory in areas of study such as cybersecurity and the management of complex book, so IT yeah. systems. What's more, ITT Tech is, is working this? to keep education within your financial reach. Painting the head make a choice else. that can make a difference. Scholarships and financial aid are available for students who qualify. Call 866-227-2208 or visit online. So like that whole stack right there, those are these are like maybe ten books I got one of these couple of months. Alright guys, well I just thought I'd uh, show you a new book Why and not? recommend it. Um, you're not going to get this, I mean, don't even try to get this online through PDF for me because I look for this book to try to get it through PDF. The only book I was able to get through PDF was Richard Shims. And that's the one that he just came out with and I got that. Alright, bye for now anyway, bye.